Happy Saturday. My real MVPs, what y'all up to today? I hope all is well. I hope everyone has what they need for this upcoming week. I'm grateful and thankful that God has carried us all through to another week. So, to all the new subscribers, hello, welcome, welcome, welcome. Mwah. I appreciate you joining the team up over here. So, y'all, we're going to have a discussion throughout the duration of me braiding my son's hair, okay? And the topic is, thou shall not judge. Think about that for a minute. So, y'all, at some point in our life, we have judged someone or just a situation that we shouldn't do. Whether it being our sister messing with a boy she shouldn't have. Whether it being somebody drinking alcohol. Whether it being a child on social media doing something that we feel they don't have no business doing. We all have judged somebody. The reality of it is, we cast a stone. We had no business casting. He, without sin, cast the first stone. So that goes when we put our mouths on people's situations, on the things that people do. We got something to say. We got an opinion. Is that our place? Let me know in the comments. Yes, I know. Yes, everybody is entitled to an opinion, but everybody is not entitled to judge and cast stones. What we fail to realize is that the same ranks that we judge people in, we gonna be judged in the ranks. So if you Judging somebody in a high, mighty standard, you're going to be judged in that high, mighty standard as well. No one has the job to judge but God. If y'all think about it, we all have been born into sin, right? We all just sin differently. If we think about it, we can view sin as a teacher. Sin teaches us why not to sin. Sin allows us to acquire experience, experience that will that God will use to help us deliver people out of the bondage of sin. Y'all heard that saying, can't nobody tell me nothing. If you ain't been through it, you can't tell me nothing. Same concept, y'all. So why are we judging at the end of the day when we need each other at the end of the day? Think about that, y'all. When we judge people, we forget that there's forgiveness and grace in God. We forget that God has forgiven us for our sins. For we all have sinned and fallen short of the glory of God. Am I right? If I'm right, Type amen in the comments. Y'all, it's easy to fall into sin. We could be up today and down tomorrow. That's why Jesus was crucified on the cross for us, for our sins, past, present, and future. So stop judging people, y'all. Stop judging people by their sins. God's love is unconditional. He loves us whether we sin or not. So who are we to be casting stones and judging other people? We're supposed to be loving people because love covers a multitude of sin, y'all. That was deep. There was deep. Because sometimes we can 
be judging people and not really realizing that we're judging people. We could just be having a conversation. And in that conversation, we're in the, we're moving in a judgmental spirit because we have something to say. But we're supposed to be quiet. That's why we got two ears, two eyes, and one mouth. So think about that, y'all. Think about where somebody like come up to you and try to have a discussion with you about somebody else's business. Don't y'all know if they telling somebody else's business, they telling your business to somebody else too? Come on now. Pay attention, y'all. Don't be so quick to judge people because they sinning differently than you. Don't be so quick to stick your nose up at somebody because they moving differently than you. Everybody at one point, a time of another, was a prodigal son or daughter. Trust me, we all sin. We all fall short of the glory of God, y'all. So don't be walking around holier than thou judging people like your house is all together because we all struggle with something. We just all struggle with different things at different times. All right, y'all. I don't have much else to say. I have given you what thus says the Lord. I pray that you all, we all receive it. I pray it makes us do better. All right, y'all. Halfway done, y'all. <laughs> I don't play no games. So we're going to have like a total of eight braids, y'all. Cover your face. Put your hands. Your whole face. All right, y'all. I'm going to get ready to end the video. As you can see, them parts are straight. I don't play no games. All right, y'all. It was a pleasure. I hope y'all got the message. Thou shall not judge. No sin is greater than the next sin. Until we meet again, be kind, be sweet, be genuine, be loving, be caring. But most importantly, treat people the way you want to be treated. All right? Mwah.